All right, guys, now that we have a solid understanding of variables in PHP, I want to talk about constants. And constants are just like variables, except for one thing. They do not vary. Let me, let me go ahead and show you an example. So I Googled WordPress 2010 theme, and this is the stocks theme that WordPress gives you when you download WordPress. So I'm looking at this header image right here, and I'm going to inspect it by right-clicking and coming down to Inspect Element. And I know that its width is 940 pixels, and its height is 198 pixels. And I know that this is a constant. They set this up as a constant and not a variable because I know WordPress will and I know this theme well. And that means that if we came in with our own logo, like villageparkmedia.com, and it was 200 pixels in width by 100 pixels in height, and we added it in here, since it's a constant, the PHP program would not care and it would go ahead and stretch my 200 by 100 pixels all the way across here to the 940 and make it look like crap because it's a constant and not a variable and it would look horrible and it would lose its resolution and it would look extremely pixelated like an old school Nintendo game. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do a constant and how to do a variable. So let's go let's go ahead back to our first.php page and let's create some PHP tags and let's go ahead and just create a variable called width equals 980. So this is not a constant. This is just a width. I'm just th this is a variable and I'm just writing this so I can compare and contrast with the constant that we are going to write right now. So to write a constant, it's define we'll give it a name of width and how big do we want it? We want it 980 as well. And I'm going to close it out. I'm just going to go ahead and type in comments right here. Here's a variable, here's a constant, and instead of writing constant right here, we write define, I don't know, it's kind of weird in the beginning, I've gotten used to it by now, it's, again, they're not my rules, I don't have any rules, so just go ahead and write define with 980, so I'm going to echo our width. I'm also going to echo break. And a little heads up. Uh oh, what's going on? And a little heads up. Um, for the break tags, you need to echo it if you're inside P tags. If you're outside P tags, we don't have to echo break tags. But again, we're inside P tags, so we need to echo the BR, or else it'll give us a parse error and our server will spit back to us that we made a, that we made a mistake. So I'm going to go ahead and control save this and see what this gives us. Uh-oh. How do we get to localhost php first.php. The connection was reset. Try again. I don't know what's going on. Problem loading page. Is my ZAMP turned off? Apologize about this. Let me pause this video for a second. That I was at www.localhost.com forward slash php forward slash first.php. So I went ahead and saved this. This is what we just created. We created this constant with a width of 980 and we echoed it and it gave us this 980. That's what we're looking for. Let me reload it. Okay. But see, we can't append this. We can't add anything to this. So say we try to take our constant and add 20 to it. What's the? Because with variables, we can do this. We can append. We can append. We can subtract. We can add. We can multiply. But with a constant, we cannot do this. So I'm going to go ahead and echo width again. Is that how we spell width? Yeah. We reload it. Parse error. We're not allowed to do it. Uh, unexpected T plus equals yada, yada, yada on line 15. Line 15 is right here. It's not letting us plus, it's not letting us add 20 pixels to our 980 that we already created because it's a constant and not a variable. Again, it does not variable. It does not vary. But we could go ahead and take this part out. If we want to go back to using a variable, we'll just use our width up here. 
And we'll add 20 to our width because variables are a lot more cooperative. I'm not saying that they're better or worse. I'm just saying if you don't want to have somebody be able to change something, set it to a constant. So we'll go and echo our width. Now it should go from 980 to an even 1000. Perfect. Okay. So you guys were able to compare and contrast what a variable is as opposed to what a constant is. And if you guys have any questions, let me know and I'll go ahead and see you guys in the next video.